Hi everybody, today I will be showing you how to make homemade bread pudding. To get started with this recipe, you need one loaf of day old bread, some milk, two eggs, and butter or margarine substitute. You then want to add one cup of milk and one cup of sugar to a saucepan that's heated on low, stirring it all together until it's nice and smooth. You'll then want to cut your bread into squares and place it in a 9 by 12 casserole dish. After you have placed your bread into the casserole dish, your mixture should be nice and creamy by now. You can add in a half a cup of chopped pecans to give your bread pudding some extra texture and flavor. You want to up the heat just a bit until it gets to a nice creamy boil. Stirring everything around to make sure nothing sticks and then reduce your heat back to low. Once the heat has been reduced to low, you want to turn it down and let it cool. While it's cool, add in two beaten eggs. Go ahead and mix your eggs in until everything is coated evenly. Once this is done, you'll then want to go ahead and pour the mixture over your bread. As you're pouring the mixture over the bread, you want to be sure that you're covering all parts of the dish making sure that everything is coated nice and evenly now your bread pudding is ready to enter the oven on 350 degrees for about 30 to 45 minutes now it's time to go ahead and remove the pudding from the oven and there you go homemade bread pudding fresh out the oven thanks for watching